Now, in a tragic incident from southern India, a five-year-old girl lost her life due to a very rare infection. It begins with symptoms resembling a common illness and eventually leads the victim into a comatose state before their death. While such conditions and related fatalities are extremely uncommon, the organisms causing this dangerous infection could be lurking in the water we use. The so-called brain-eating amoeba was discovered in 1965. Its formal name is Negleria foleri. The single-celled organism thrives in warm climates and can be found in freshwater lakes, rivers, and even hot springs. In addition to natural sources, it may also be present in swimming pools, tap water, or contaminated water. When this amoeba enters the human body, it causes severe inflammation and eventually destroys brain tissue. The amoeba was first identified in Australia, but it is believed to have evolved in the US. The term brain-eating amoeba makes it sound like a tiny zombie stalking the human skull, but brains are actually accidental food for them. Once the brain-eating amoeba enters the human body, it triggers common symptoms like headache, fever, vomiting, loss of appetite, and loss of taste. These symptoms can occur within two days or three weeks of the amoeba entering the nasal passage. Unfortunately, most people who contract the infection die within a week. Moreover, the symptoms are too common to specifically identify the presence of the brain-eating amoeba, making it challenging to diagnose. Experts say if cases of brain-eating amoeba are reported in the vicinity, then one should avoid swimming in lakes or rivers. Doctors also advise using distilled or boiled tap water when rinsing your sinuses or cleansing your nasal passages. For all the latest news, download the Wion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.